Hi again, this is Andrea from My Dream of Crafting. Um, this is going to be a really quick time lapse. Um, I decided to do this last night on the fly. I was making a Halloween bag and um, I was uh, going to decorate the outside with this image and I figured, well, I got to cut it out anyway, so I'll just do a really quick time lapse for you guys. So um, you're going to see the be able to see the bag um, by at the end of the movie. Or time lapse, sorry. Um, so yeah. I'm just cutting out the mouth here of the uh, ghost you saw. So, um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> um, this is a six times normal speed. If you like this speed, let me know. Um, I don't know if it's just because I keep looking at them or what, but the four times seems to be really slow now. So um, just let me know if this just gets too fast and I'll knock it back down. But, um, so I'm gonna, the, the, what do you call it? The bag is black, so, um, I'm not gonna do the outline of the ghost. So this is the glow-in-the-dark tape again. Um, as I stated before, it's a Halloween bag, so this is something, you know, that a kid would use, um, for trick-or-treating, so it would be dark outside, obviously, so they could use it in the dark, and the little ghost would glow. I think that would be really cool. So just going to cut this out of the glow in the dark tape. I put the mouth on just so I could uh, see where everything's going to line up and you know just not have to do it later. I screwed up on that one side of the mouth so I'm just cutting out of just freehanding a little you know something to do to put on that side. I really like this image it's really cute. I'm really glad it printed out the way it did. So I realized about the time I got done with the ghost that I completely forgot to, to cut out the eyes before I cut out the ghost. <laughs> about here I'm like shoot I forgot his eyes. So um, you'll see me do that at the end of the video. It, it turned out alright. So just trying to find my lines. The one bad thing about the glow in the dark tape, you can't really see your cutout lines. So I'm looking at the image trying to figure out where where I need to cut and I don't know what happened here, but somehow his tail disappeared. I don't know. So I going to use that little piece right there to try and uh, make it. That was that one was too small, so I'm like, forget it, we'll just do it this way. It's sort of freehand, not really, but I got his tail back, so that's fine by me. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. So I'm pulling this up, pulling this up, and oh, it comes off, and I'm like, you know what, I'm just going to place it. So, the glow-in-the-dark tape is awesome, but it's really, really hard to work with. I love it, though. It looks awesome when you get it down. But it's just really hard to work with. Because it's, it's just so sticky. So. Now we pull this up. And about here, I realized I forgot to take that piece out. It was just really hard to see where my lines were. So I tried to set this using the template and then I'm like, screw it, I have half of them on there, I can figure out the rest. So I'm just overlapping where it's supposed to be and smoothing that out. And now I have to do um, the eyes, which uh, were actually harder than I expected them to be. I actually freehanded the second eye. I got the first one done, but the second one fell apart on me. So they didn't look hard, but trying to pull them up off the mat was not yeah was not happy so just cutting out the middle there and then cutting around the eye and there's one there you go so we're gonna place that one. This one came out alright, but the second one, you'll see when I try and, for some odd reason, when I try and uh, 
rip this up. Yeah, it's gonna completely tear apart on me, so I figured, eh, I'll just freehand it. It, uh, turned out a little small, but, um, I don't know how it turned out small, but it actually made the, uh, it gave a little more character to the image. Ma made him even sillier than he actually was. So uh, it, it actually really turned out cute. I liked it. I like it a lot. And it's not too much smaller. So, there we go. And that's the inside. And here I'm going to show you the in, uh, it in the dark. So thanks for watching.